everyone in this video we are going to discuss something very important guess what it is about the northern plain of india and its classification on the basis of relief features as you know that the northern plains are flat and leveled land but it would amaze you to know that these vast plains also have diverse relief features according to the variations in the relief features the northern plains can be divided into four regions these are called bhabar terai bhangar and khadar i know you'd be curious to know the important features of these regions so let us begin as you have studied in my previous video that the rivers indus ganga and the brahmaputra come down from the mountains and deposit pebbles in a narrow belt of about 8 to 16 kilometers in width they are lying parallel to the slope of the shivalik this narrow belt is known as bhabar do you know all the rivers disappear in this bhabar belt but why it is because of the deposition of a huge number of pebbles and rock debris that the streams cannot be seen on the surface but they are present there flowing under the ground south of this belt is the terai region the streams of rivers reemerge or you can say the rivers can be seen because this region is composed of comparatively finer alluvium due to the presence of rivers a wet swampy and marshy region is found this area was once a thickly forested region full of wildlife the forests have now been cleared to create agricultural land and to settle migrants from pakistan after the partition the next region is bhangar it lies above the flood plains of the rivers it is the largest part of the northern plain formed of old alluvial soil it contains calcareous deposits or you can say kankar but what about the soil that is deposited over the flood plain let me tell you every year when flood comes the new alluvial soil is deposited near the river bank these are fine soils and make the flood plain very fertile these younger deposits of the flood plains are called khadar these soils are very good for intensive agriculture do you know the bhangar soil forms a terrace like feature what does this mean to understand it better let us draw a diagram suppose this is a river and it deposits fine soil near the river bank that means here somewhere this is young and new soil also known as khadar when you go above this region you would find old soil that was deposited last year or last to last year this is bhangar these are not so fertile now thus you can see how bhangar is forming a terrace like feature i hope this is clear to you so children let us end today's class here in the next video we will continue with the peninsular plateau hope you found my video interesting do like and subscribe to my channel if you want to watch more such interesting videos thank you everyone